Hypixel released summer achievements and basically I'm going to explain every single achievement to you and how to get them. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe because it really means a lot and I want to get close to 30k so yeah. Anyway yeah enjoy this video and I will see you guys at the end of the video. Basically, the first achievement is Secret Achievement. It's only unlocked by 0.01% of the players. Basically, what you're going to want to do is go left of spawn, go over to here to the Fishing Hunt. What you're going to want to do then is sit here for six and a half hours or more. I sat here for a few days. And you're going to catch this rear fish. Basically, you're going to sit here for a long time. It'll say in chat when you catch a rear fish. And basically, you have to catch seven different rare fish. I've been here for about three days, about five hours each day, and I have yet to caught one. This challenge is very hard and time consuming. So, yeah, I'm gonna move on to the next challenge. The next achievement is Bird Plane. Nope, it's just the pink sheep. Win a game of farm hunt as a pink sheep. Pretty much what I did this entire time was hide in this hut while the people in my party guarded me. That's basically how the easiest way to complete the challenges is get two or three friends, hide somewhere, and make sure that the hunters do not go for you. And have them be the hunters. The next achievement is Expert Diver. Reach 85 points in a game of Scuba Simulator. Basically what I did for this one was gather about three or four friends and they all targeted one person that was getting a lot of the items. That way I was able to go grab everything while they were targeting the person tryharding. Near the end of the video where I go over the tiered achievements, I will explain the best strategy to get these points. The next achievement is Pool Party. Win a game behind and seek party pooper on the pool party map. There's really no strategy to this. I just went for the objectives and I just won through that. It's not really anything hard. This was one of the easiest ones. The fifth achievement is Australian Winter. Have your snowman hit players with snowballs 500 times while using snowmen in Mega Wall. So this achievement is very hard to get, which is why I'm not going to get it. But basically what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to shop, you're going to want to go to buy Mythic class. You basically want to get the snowman class. And that's basically it um, for that one. Like I said, this one's really hard to get, so I'm not going to be able to get it. But basically you're going to have to just grind for a few hours and hopefully you could get a snowman to hit someone 500 times in one game. The next challenge is Shockwave. Get 15 kills in one game of TNT Wizards using Storm Wizard. Alright, I got three kills. This guy's just coming back and letting me kill him. <laughs> Basically, this is the only way you pretty much do it. Just ask to kill people. That's literally the only way this would actually work. It's just to let people, let someone kill, keep kill, uh, dying to you. One more! Yay! I got the achievement! The next achievement is Bring the Storm. Win a game of Warlords using the Thunderlord subclass of a shar Shaman. I don't know how to say that. So what you're going to want to do is go to Warlords and get the Texture Pack, get the Shaman, and Thunderlord. And now it's active, so now you're going to go in the game. Basically, I just AFK'd until one of the games my team actually won. And that's pretty much how you do it easiest. The next one is Grillmaster. Kill five players in a Skywars game with the barbecue kill message. So you're going to want to go to My Cosmetics, Kill Message, and go to Barbecue and select it. Solo Normal is probably the easiest for it. You have to get five kills in one game. So, yeah. Alright, so I have two kills right now, and this is going to be my third, third kill right now. And I got the five kills, and I got Grill Master. And just to win. Alright, GG. The next achievement is Home Run. Knock a player into the void while using the baseball player kit in Skywars. You're going to want to go shop, kits and perks, normal kits, make sure you have the baseball player kit enabled. And I knocked him into the void, and I get the achievement. Home run. Nice KB, kid! And... GG. The next achievement is Lightning Rod. Get struck by lightning in Murder Mystery. I just have to win as innocent. Which should be easy, right? Oh wait, no, I just have to get a lightning strike. I forgot. Okay, never mind. I have to yeah, die. How are you gonna live? I, 
I have to die as an innocent. But I can't die, be like, by the murderer. That's the problem. Yes. Yeah, so, Are you murderer? So let's just, like, no, I'm innocent. What do you think I'm a murderer? You promise? You promise? You're not gonna kill me? You just go underground. Me. Yes. Yes. Door. <laughs> Lightning <laughs> straight <laughs> me. Oh, that was so... I died. Let's go. I died. No! Oh my god! Bro, because of this achievement, like... I hate my died. life. Yeah! Dance party! Dance party, let's go! Yeah! Yes, let's go! Ooh, lightning rod! To explain it further, basically you have to get the map Cruise Ship. This is the only map that will lightning strike, and that's how you pretty much do this achievement. The next achievement is called Punch Out. Knock a player into the void using a punched enchanted bow in Bed Wars. My specialty. You're gonna wanna join Bed Wars. You're gonna wanna join a solo game, I guess. I don't know anymore. Basically, I just grab 48 blocks and I just rush immediately. I normally don't prop my bed on, on solos. This guy is prodding his bed, which is taking more time, and if he's not good at PvP, his bed is gonna be gone no matter what. I don't know why you jumped there. You could have went for my bed. All right, so now that that person's gone, what you're gonna wanna do is quickly get to mid because as long as there's no one at mid yet, you should be good. All right, so basically we have eight emeralds right now. So we're gonna head back, get a punch bow, and yeah. Would have much rather spent po this on potions, but guess I can't. I don't know how a punch bow is summer, summer vibes. Now there's people going to be tryharding. Get a punch bow, some arrows, and yeah, that's pretty much it. He already made it to white, sadly, so I'm not able to actually kill him with a punch bow. And that was the kill. As you guys can see, I got the chat message, and I fell into the void from lag. Yay! Aqua's probably upset that I kinda did that, so I'm gonna quickly rush red and then I'll go back to my base. And they are dead. All right. And I'm gonna jump in the void before pink gets to me because pink is heading over and he fell in the void. All right, so now it's just one person left. Why do you think that fireball was gonna do anything? Why do you think that fireball was gonna do anything? Why do you think that fireball was gonna do anything? Those fireballs don't do anything. I want him to get to the edge so I can fireball him off. He has prot, so he might kill me. Never mind. I am perfectly fine. And GG, I win. Now, once you completed the challenge achievement, you're gonna to wanna to move over to the tiered achievements. I'm gonna be giving tips for each one of these and how to complete them fastest and easiest. This one is called Gone Fishing. The first achievement is fish 10 treasure items while fishing in the main lobby. Basically, there's really no easy tactic to this. You just wanna to go to a lobby with no one in it and just keep fishing until you reach this, pretty much. You're able to go to 50 and then finally 100. The next achievement is buy 750 items in Bed Wars. Shopaholic. Then it's 1,500, 2,500, 5,000 and then 7,500. The easiest tactic to do this is to go into the Bedwars lobby, go into 4v4s, and basically what you're gonna wanna do is get into the gen and let your team do the work. You're just gonna go over here and right click blocks infinitely. Keep getting iron and keep doing it. It doesn't count per shop like this. It counts per item you buy. So you could just spam this one time and you would be able to get the achievements. The next one is called Treasure Hoarder 1. Score 100 points in Scuba Simulator. You do not have to complete this in one game. You're able to score in multiple games. And then there's 1,000 points, 3,000 points, 6,000, and then 10,000. Best way to do this is to go into Scuba Simulator. Now the strat is, see where the ship is? You're gonna wanna go right next to the ship into the mines. Basically, you're just gonna wanna keep running around here and grabbing them all. Always check the inside over here because there could happen to be one. See, I just got treasure hoarder too. And you're wanna you're gonna wanna keep doing this, keep finding them. There's a ton of more spots, but I'm gonna go into the next area. Once you completely run out of spots in the cave area, you're gonna wanna sprint right next to the cave where I was talking I was talking about the ship just two seconds ago. There's always a lot of presence inside the ship as long as anyone didn't get to the ship yet. And pretty much you could just run around. The best area to go is probably up there. This also works with the actual achievement where you have to collect 85 in one game. 
because these two places should give you 85 but if you have not gotten 85 if you come over here check all the houses there's downstairs and most likely there's going to be presents downstairs finally the last tiered achievement is treasure master win five games of scuba simulator win 10 games 15 games 25 games and then 50 games basically do the same strat that i just showed in the previous one and you should probably win the game easily that's going to be it for today's video make sure to leave a like and subscribe please do if you guys found this helpful at all i'm really trying to grow on youtube so it really helps a ton anyway be, uh, expect more videos for guides and stuff coming out once more stuff comes out and yeah see you guys in a few days for another video